know, excited to be back in the State Farm Center and, and uh, in front of our great fans and excited to uh, uh, see how this team performs for the first time under the lights and, and uh, in front of people. So uh, we've had a good, uh, a good fall. I'm excited about uh, our growth. I'm excited about our improvement. Uh, and, and it'll be an opportunity to uh, see how, how, how guys react. And, and uh, that's always uh, uh, what these exhibition games are for. We had a, uh, a secret scrimmage that uh, was, was uh, uh, enlightening uh, in a lot of ways. Uh, you know, you, you face a Frank Martin team and you know exactly what you're going to get in terms of uh, the effort, the rebounding, the defensive uh, tenacity. Uh, that was great for our team. Uh, to see that and, and to grow, and then it was a great opportunity for us to, to also go on the road, which we have to do here in a week, and kind of get that feeling out of the way. And uh, so that, that scrimmage was, um, was very beneficial for us and, and uh, in, in more ways than one, and now we get a home game and, and, uh, against a very, very good Lewis team, uh, a team that won 25 games last year, a team that is uh, just absolutely dynamite from three-point range. Uh, they've already scrimmaged a, a Division One opponent uh, in Chicago State, which which uh, uh, they were very impressive. So this will be a different type of, uh, of team than what we faced in South Carolina in terms of not, not as big and as athletic, but a team that is very very effective in doing what they do. Uh, you know, they've got bigs who really shoot the cover off of it. Uh, from three, and, and uh, they're a veteran team who knows how to win. So, uh, great opportunity for us to, to, to see something a little bit different. What did you learn from your guys just, you know, playing against somebody else other than themselves in that secret scrimmage? Yeah, that's what it's all about is, is you, you, get to, you get to find out what, what you see. I, I loved our toughness. I loved our competitiveness. I thought that, uh, you know, you, you, you get a, a, a Frank Martin team, and, and you know they're going to be extremely big. They're going to be extremely physical. Uh, they look all of that. They look the part. I mean, they're, uh, they're, they're, they're grown men and extremely strong, yet we handled that very well. Uh, we were very, very competitive on the glass, uh, which was, was something we wanted to, we wanted to shore up, and, and we did that. Frank's always got one of the top rebounding teams, not just in the SEC, but in the country. Uh, so we felt great about that. and, and uh, uh, you know, I, I, I like the way our guys handled that, and, and so uh, you know, along with along with facing that pressure and having somebody in your jersey, uh, you know, I think the first few minutes of, of, of all segments, you know, kind of got us on our heels. And then we really settled in and did some did some nice things at uh, at the offense. Right, what's the plan minutes wise? Maybe get the, are you planning on getting the freshmen in there a little bit more in this exhibition? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, we played them. Uh, we played them all, Benjamin, uh, in the morning segment at South Carolina. Uh, we we held out. He did a workout with uh, with Fletch. Uh, the afternoon piece, uh, we played him. Uh, yesterday was his first full day. Uh, we had to be off Monday and Tuesday because of NCA rules, and, and we got three games next week uh, without a day off. So uh, we took Monday and Tuesday off. And then uh, yesterday was, was Benjamin's first full day of being in practice for, for the duration. So, uh, you know, yeah, we'll get Kofi out there. And, and Jermaine did not play in South Carolina. Jermaine had a, a little tweak in his hamstring. We held him out for precautionary measures. Uh, but he is now back in practice. And, and uh, you know, hope to get those guys uh, some, some, some good amount of minutes uh, tomorrow night. Any other health concerns? No. You said Ben played in the scrimmage? He did. How, just how do you look? Yeah, he was good. I, he was nervous. He was like any other freshman that hadn't practiced in a long time. And, you know, Benjamin's very cerebral. He understands exactly what we're, uh, what we're doing. Uh, you know, he threw an overhead pass in a high-low situation to Georgie that they're still trying to get still embedded in the wall. <laughs> uh, you know, he threw it so hard. He was just nervous and uptight, but uh, he'll play his way out of that. But his instincts, he made a couple great passes. Uh, uh, defensively, was was fine. So, uh, you know, typical freshman stuff. And, and, and again, let's remember, Ben hadn't practiced since uh, since July.
Where's Jones, some of the... Jones going to play Friday? No. And so he'll be suspended to a certain point? Until no I determine otherwise. Okay. What's just the road ahead look like for him? Who? Oh. Jones? Suspended, and I made made a statement on that. I'm not going to comment on on that anymore. We've got we've got uh, uh, expectations that we have. He's in practice every day. We have expectations that have to be met, and, and uh, uh, you know we're we're student athletes, at the University of Illinois, and, and uh, there's responsibilities in both those areas. Did you get a chance to play Georgia and Kofi together in South Carolina? We did. What did you make of that? Yeah, we did. We did. They did some very very good things. Uh, you know, we, we talk about. Uh, maybe Kofi and his adjustment. It's also a pretty nice adjustment for, for Georgie, having to guard a little more on the perimeter, having to guard uh, athletic fours. Uh, and, and he did very well in that area. Uh, we looked a lot at uh, uh, you know at the offensive end, some things that were very, very positive with, with both those guys. You know, we know Georgie can really pass. Uh, and and you know, the one thing that we we know is Kofi's Kofi's going to make some mistakes. He's a freshman. He's still, uh, but his effort was great and he was effective on the glass. And, and uh, you know, we get both those guys uh, rebounding the basketball. We can be uh, we can be a legit force. So you've talked about tempering expectations with Kofi for the fans, but what in the early games of the year looks like success? What are the expectations that you have for him? Uh, I, I I don't I don't put those on him. I think that if you do, then you cap it. Uh, he's got a chance to be really good, uh, but he's also got a long way to go. He's, he's, you don't just walk out here as a freshman and, and, and play college basketball when guys are 22, 23 years old. And, 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 you know, he's got to clean up his footwork. He's got to clean up the small, uh, very, very important things that, that allow us to run offense better and, and, and help side defensive things. And he'll do some things because of his size that, that others can't. But uh, you know, we're, I'm, I'm always going to temper uh, my emotions and, until I see him, and then we can continue to, to work and grow in those areas. How important is tomorrow night just for the motions and dress rehearsal of all that goes into a game, let alone the game itself? We damn well better not go through the motions. Uh, well, I mean, like lineups yeah. and, and that, no, you know, it, and no, it's important. We sat out here and we talked today about how we substitute and, and taking a towel and, and, and how we handle uh, our bench during during key moments and how we sit during timeouts and and so that's very important. You know, we, we haven't done that. Uh, uh, and again, it, it's a different vibe uh, when you. I don't care. We played South Carolina in front of nobody, and it's a different vibe when you put arena full of people and you turn the lights on and, and uh, you know so how guys react to that will be great starting lineups announced the national anthem all those things uh, it's great to get that out of the way much less of a learning process now with fewer new guys than you had a year ago when you guys did this no doubt no doubt I you're just more comfortable I'm more comfortable as a coach and uh, what they're gonna do you know there's there's a trust factor that is, is much higher uh, just simply because we got a group of guys that, that know and, and, and they know what we're trying to look for offensively. They know the counters to uh, a certain type of defense and those are the things that uh, uh, you know we weren't even close to a year ago at this time being able to handle. We were still trying to understand what the college game was about and uh, yeah big difference. You say you kind of Mix and match with some lineups you know, during your know, practice. Yeah. Is tomorrow going to look maybe more like a rotation for a season, or are you going to still be experimenting? No, we're going to experiment a little bit. We're going to. There's no doubt about that. We're going to. Uh, you know, we're going to continue to work on some things. Uh, you know, with a little smaller lineup sometimes, with a little bigger lineup. Um, you know, I, I've got an idea how I want to handle certain guys in, in, in rotations. Uh, you'll you'll see that. Uh, I'm still trying to figure out around media timeouts how I want to substitute. You know, I like doing that a lot. You know, uh, you know in, in the scrimmage of South Carolina, I sub Kofi right before the first media. Um, you know, we'll see how that works out. Uh, get him his, his first win under him. And, but yeah, it's we're we're still playing with a lot of that, but we'll we'll look at a lot of different things tomorrow. What's the biggest thing you want to take away from tomorrow night? A win, growth, uh, 
Um, you know, I, I think it's, it's, it's comfort, understanding what it's like to play. Uh, we want to be a, we want to be a team that no matter uh, what the, what the front of the, the, the jersey says or the name on the back says uh, or who they're guarding, uh, we show up and we do our job every day. We're looking for that consistency and, and uh, you know, we've, we've got a great opponent that gives us something different. We've got to learn to execute a game plan. This is our first full scout. We didn't scout South Carolina at all. We just showed up and played and did our deal. Uh, this this we've, we, we've put some stuff together and it's our first scouting report for our guys. So uh, we'll see how their attention to detail is and that's an area we have to make a uh, a big improvement in from last year. Do you like 